everyone my name is the life of daniel and i want to welcome you to this episode of this video in this video i want to take you through the unboxing of the airtel 5g smart box we call it airtel 5g rotor it's very common of recent in uganda because it's uh, working well for people and uh, it's affordable and uh, depending on the fact that the data is unlimited people are preferring it of recent so i happened to get the airtel 5g rotor it's here in the box i got it here it's not the first time i'm gonna unbox it but i have unboxed it before when i was being registered for it and testing it if it can work so don't think it's completely the unboxing when it's not been tampered with but i have already opened it before but still i'm gonna do it right now so this is the airtel 5g smart box as you can see this is how the box looks like i hope we get that well i'm gonna unbox and test it and we see if it can work well and you also take your decision if you want to buy it or if you want to use it and yeah let's get started so i am going to open this box the airtel 5g rotor is inside As I told you before, I had opened it in order to try to register and test. So that's why opening it has been easy for me and more simple, you know. This is it. This is it. I hope you see how it's nice looking. Trying to remove it and removing is quite hard. So let me first open this part. This part I've opened. I have some, some things which come with it. Let us first remove everything inside and I will talk about them. So, I'm removing everything inside. I'm removing everything inside. I'm removing everything inside. And finally is this. And, uh, and then this one, you might understand it. This one I can tell straight away. It's the user manual that is always provided in several products that you buy. This is the user manual. So I'm gonna put this back my consumption if i'm not well versed with something i can read through and then understand it you too if you buy you can you get that on inside so this is the smart box the box is away now back to the thing now so this is the the sim card that you are given when you buy this is the sim card this rotor it comes with a free sim card they say so yeah a free sim card so all you need is your national id you register and then they activate the wi-fi router and then come with this the sim card is placed inside this one here is the main product this is the main product the airtel 5g router as you can see it's the main product yes what you need most and this main product is accompanied by this this one in the box is the power bank this rotor comes with a power bank this power bank, I see it's a, what's the capacity? Yeah, I think it's a good power bank on your rotor. If there, if you are traveling or if you, your power has gone off, there is no electricity. So you can connect it from here. Uh, and then you can use it when there is no electricity. It's the cable for connecting the Wi-Fi rotor to electricity. You can take it to an extension or a socket like and this is the ethernet cable it comes with one ethernet cable and uh, if you want to connect more 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 devices it, you are advised to buy more for yourself but it comes with one ethernet cable this cable can be used to connect your wi-fi router to your laptop or computer your gaming console you can also use it to connect to your smart tv and it will not require you to put any password from the wi-fi router you'll just connect it and it works straight away yes wi-fi router to your laptop to your computer if you have set a password it will require somebody to put a password in order for it to work so this is the cable this cable is put from here where this one this cable is put from here this cable is put from here so let me first connect this I'm going to connect this I'm going to connect this Wi-Fi router to the socket and you see
fix from here. I see some green lights. There's some green. I see green light here. There is green light. Yes. I see green light. Do you see it too? So this green light, this is the WPS button. This button is used for connecting your Wi-Fi router to several devices without requiring a password. Like if you want to connect your friends, your friends are within. This Wi-Fi router can connect up to 64 devices simultaneously. So you can, I see the green lights are now too. This is the power button. I see like sign of power button. This is the 4G and this is 5G. For me, my device, my smartphone I'm using is for 4G. I'm using 4G. That's why you're seeing the option of 5G does not show any green light. So when you want to use 5G, this Wi-Fi router comes with two options. 4G, 5G, 3G. Connecting your Wi-Fi in your phone, there, there are two options. There is uh, 4G and then 5G. But if you don't have a 5G device, you can select 4G. And then the second option is 5G. That's for 5G devices. So the importance of this router is that it can work for your 4G devices and it can also work for your 5G devices. So it's okay there. So now I'm seeing the green lights are full. And uh, now I think I need to connect some devices and test. This is the power bank. I don't need it now because I have electricity. Let me put it there. Uh, I have here my laptop and I want to connect my laptop. I am going to connect my laptop using the Ethernet cable. I'm gonna fix I'm going to fix from here. So I hope you're seeing where I'm fixing from. There are three three ports there. So if you need more cables, you buy for yourself. It comes with only one cable. So I have fixed it there. And so I am going to test the internet of this Wi-Fi router on my PC. So I'm going to Google Chrome and I see Galaxy S10 Plus, that is my smartphone, other smartphone, it has, I had a hotspot, it, it was a, a hotspot with this one, uh, and it is connected currently, Life of Galaxy, the Life's Galaxy S10 Plus, that was just hotspot Wi-Fi, but the one for this router is this one, that is the first one having the Airtel, Airtel X25 and so on and so on and then the second option there I don't know if you can see the second option there it has a 5G it has 5G but the device that I'm using is not 5G so I'm gonna select the first option I'll select the first option when I select the first option I'm required to put my password and after putting the password it will be automatic I'll connect it automatically every time I go to Wi-Fi just connects my device automatically so put password and it's now connected you can see it is showing connected so let me try and go to youtube perfect when i go to youtube the wi-fi router is working properly so let me search, let me search, this is one of my video playing, so it's working fine. If you had a chance to change one thing on the continent, what would it be? Ooh, you would, the way people think to understand. 
understand that with the riches in the, in the world, in the... The smartphone is working very fine and it's very fast. And yet it is 4G. I don't know if I have a 5G smartphone and the connect, I think the speed can just go, wow.